New tonight, violence taking place across mid-Michigan on the first day of summer, following a murder in both Bay City and Saginaw, and a shooting injuring a teen, all happening Friday night and early this morning. But today, a local community hopes to spread the message of peace. TV5's Cody Kaczynski was in Flint for a unity march against violence. I miss my baby. And people say it's going to be all right, but it'll never be all right. This is just one mother's cry for justice that echoes throughout Flint. Patricia Brewster lost her son Sultan, also known as Manny Brewster, this March to a gunshot wound on Flint's south side. Police are still looking for his killer. I just want some justice for my son, and I won't rest until I have it. Patricia is surrounded today by those with a similar story. The 18th annual Flint Unity March brings together families that have been impacted by violence and those that support change in the community. The support makes you feel wonderful because there are other people that have lost loved ones, parents who've lost children to senseless murders. The violence has to stop. Patricia is partnering with Crime Stoppers of Flint and Genesee County to hopefully track down her son's murderer. They are offering a cash reward up to $2,500. While hundreds march the streets off of Martin Luther King Boulevard, Crime Stoppers reminds them that speaking up about these crimes is the right thing to do. We all understand what we're going through and we're here to support each other, but we're also here to stop this silence and stop this violence. WOW Outreach in partnership with 30 other community programs will continue to march year after year, spreading messages of peace and resources to hopefully prevent violence in the future. To keep standing together, keep having more rallies, Everybody speak up. If you know something, speak up. There's no such thing as a snitch code. Speak up. We're all family. This unites us as family. In Flint, Cody Kaczynski, WNEM TV5.